Werewolf is an awesome party game that pits a divided town against a minority of werewolves that are hiding among them. And it's an all-out fight to the death. Uh, this game show that you're going to see performed live is uh, a lot similar to the uh, party game, though we've made some minor changes that you probably won't even notice for the purpose of having a little bit more fun on stage. The small town... Um, what was that town's name again? I'm struggling to remember it. Do you guys know the name of this Doonesville. town? Doonesville! 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 Doonesville, of course! Doom! Doom! Doomsville! Yes, I don't know why I could have gotten that wrong! Doomsville! Aptly named, of course. Aptly named. But as any great story, there are characters. There isn't just a narrator who narrates everything. Of course not! There are characters! These seven, these seven people, through their actions or inactions, will decide the fate of that town tonight. It's very sweet. You are who? I am a reporter from Alaska. <laughs> <laughs> and I am excited to be here. And you are? A rich asshole. <laughs> yes, of course you are. Of course you are. Who are you again? The priest's non-sexual. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's true. It's true they did not specify sexual when they said your name. So we'll go with that. Whatever you want to believe. I mean, you know. Uh, and who do we have over here? A very ineffective sit board. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, you might want to try some darker colors if you want to be, you know, maybe a little more force choking in there. And who are you? Perhaps you want to tell us a song. <laughs> I need to save that for later. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Chris And you are! Very, very disgruntled time traveler. <laughs> of course you are, of course you are. Of course, sir. Did you leave your your time machine in your other in your other jacket? Yes. Okay. I understand. I understand. And you are free tonight. Oh. <laughs> Characters, but as those of you who have played Werewolf know, in addition to being these interesting characters, they're going to have secret roles. And wake up! It's a pretty happy day for the people of the town of Doomsville. <laughs> Except it's not a happy day because the mayor has been murdered! Oh my god! Yes. $500! Oh my god! <laughs> It's a very somebody beat somebody, me to it. Somebody beat you to it, in fact. Somebody the beat me to it, and I'm a reporter. I am always first on the scene. <laughs> it's, in fact, very, it's in fact very interesting that you mentioned that because as you are reporting, as you are reporting on this grisly murder, you've determined, in fact, that it cannot be argued that the mayor was killed by werewolves. How horrible! <laughs> it could have been a furry. <laughs> Yeah, it could have yes. been a furry. I was pulled back. So <laughs> they were sins but upon God. The thing, about, the thing about the furries, though, is that FurryCon was going on last yesterday in a different part of the, of the, you know, alas, a different part of the country. And so all of the furries were there and not here. All going to hell. Ah. You mean one furry putting an old straight loose and uh, come in here to do no, the film and not at all. conduct the murder? No. No. Absolutely. Okay, no. All right. I can tell you one thing, they're very freaky. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh uh, I, I wish I could go back and not hear that. <laughs> <laughs> it was a werewolf? Sorry, that fixed point in time. Thing. That's a fixed point in time. I tried. Excuse me, sir, can you go back in time? Everybody, we're forgetting the worst thing is that this poor man is dead, and we need to 
have a proper Christian burial. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody hold hands and pray. Let's, let's all pray. Let's all help. pray. If this is a Disney movie, it's most like my mother or father. Well, which is it? Both. Oh. What? I'm so sorry for your loss. You can come work at my we build the wall. <laughs> oh, oh, what's that, Tyler? Did you get did you you got some some blood on your altar boy? Your altar boy, uh... No, it's just some no. red, that's just some oh, red tape. Oh, it's just some red right tape. Down. Never mind, I got, I got excited for it. It's <laughs> some red tape. It's, it's the blood of Christ. Oh! oh. I want to know... It's wine, everybody, it's wine! I want to know who killed the bastard, because he owes me $500, and whoever killed him, I want to know. You know, he's dead, so you could just, like, loot him. You, you do know if you need the money, I got some. <laughs> All right, let my reporter duties get to work here. He's only got 50. Ma'am, where were you last night? I may have been doing business with a certain someone. Um, can you confirm or deny who it is? Uh, they owe me a lot of money. Are they here in this room right now? Yes. Do you wish to oblige as to who you are with? I saw these two doing it in the bushes. <laughs> what? How did you see them? Are you what? not Christian? Oh. I was on my way home from church. <laughs> what kind of Christian are you? Are you a peeping Tom? <laughs> my name is Tom. <laughs> but I do not take okay. part in the act of peeping. Okay. Why were you peeping at us at 12 in the morning? 12 what were you doing? Yeah. I saw someone in the bushes uh, at 8 p.m. Oh, that That's when I was coming That's back from church. Yeah, that was nice. Might have been these two. I'm not sure. <laughs> it wasn't me. It's a very interesting story, Mr. <laughs> Tom is saying here. Some shenanigans going on in the bushes at 8 p.m. We do seem to believe that Tom the Peeper is lying. Tom, what cause would you have Tom at? I have no cause to lie. I was coming back from church. I was spending an evening with the priest. Not oh. like that. <laughs> Not like that. The priest is right over here. Right? <laughs> Step up, man. The priest is in 2016. <laughs> do you see me coming back to eat, right? I am not a witness to this whatsoever. I don't know who you are, Tom, so <laughs> leave it back. Your story is falling through like a, a bag of sticks. That's a say, right? No. I'm the narrator. I can take up say. So the question is, did anybody else see anything else? What about you, Miss First on the Scene? Oh. 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 I said I was You're not first on the scene. But normally you are. You're a shitty right. reporter. Oh. <laughs> I am a shitty reporter, apparently. When it comes to murders in Doomsdayville town. Yeah. It's because you're from Alaska, isn't it? I am so far away. This is why we don't find Alaska. It was at this oh. time that Leanne dearly missed her home. I dearly miss my home at this time. <laughs> I'm not buying this. Well, it looks like to me that it could be either of the two of them. The reporter who was late, or the devout Christian who decided to speak. <laughs> <laughs> there are best. There are best bets this way. Perhaps. Now, but there's one thing that we haven't questioned here. Now, there might be one person in the room here a bit more evil than I am, and that's the Sith Lord over here. Oh, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's true. That's, that's not something. true at all. You are the head of the Dark Forces. He's also really and I am a Sith Lord. That is job. So that is you should true. be pretending to be bad at your job. job. What I'm hearing then. I pretend to be good at my job. You see? We all that's pretend to be different. good. That's that's employment. <laughs> so what I'm hearing that what I'm hearing then is that the rest of you suspect most of all the poor altar boy and the Sith Lord. Is that the correct? I believe it was the No 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 no. Me, me and him were yeah. together. It's, oh. he's, he's cool. He's cool. He's cool. <laughs> he's cool. Oh. So so then we believe the reporter is the is the perhaps more culpable one. I think you're wrong. I think you guys are all bigger than you pay right now. Alright, well, reporter, mm -hmm. uh, altar boy, please stand up and address the audience. Give your last words and convince everyone in this room why 
you should not be hanged <laughs> under suspicion of being a werewolf. Because we hang in 2016. Because that's what we do in the town of Doomsville. It's in fact how it got its name. If we suspect you're a werewolf, we hang you. Or if you stole a piece of gum, we hang you. Or if I don't like you. Or if she doesn't like you, we hang you. Or if there's anything else suspicious, like maybe you smell funny, we hang you. Then I definitely might not like you. All right. Now we can say she got a new hat. We should hang her. It's true. It's a hanging hat. Who gets a new hat without having something to hide? <laughs> I don't know, but let's hold that thought for the for the for the tomorrow, because Leanne very much wants to try to save her baby. Uh, yeah. So um, I guess I'll just come out with it. Um, last night I left uh, the office early. Uh, there was no news to report. Um, so I went home and um, I watched a couple episodes of Sex in the City that uh, was on my PBR. <laughs> uh, you can check the timestamps of the times I was watching it if you need proof. And um, I, I took my microphone with me and I was just pretending it was Mr. Rick. Okay! <laughs> Boy Tom? I just want to say that all of you are God's children and no matter what your decision, you will all still be accepted into heaven, as will I, upon all our good motives. But if we hang you, we're all going to hell, aren't we? I don't want to think about God. About it's it's, it's iffy. <laughs> <laughs> I do. All right, fair enough. So the rest of you, what do you think? The altar boy? I think it was the kid. Or the ant. I mean, I oh. could have shown you Mr. Big if you know what I'm saying, babe. <laughs> like, you know, oh. I think I'm going to go with her. You You're going to go with her? her? Yes. You're going with her? I, I see two money votes on for the end. Three <laughs> votes for the end. Oh. I'm sorry, the end. Please take a seat. You have been hung. Yeah, that's the right one. You did. Like Mr. Big. Goodbye! 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 Why are you so chipper? <laughs> It's a good question, one we can revisit tomorrow, because now you must all go to sleep. I'm gonna go sleep on my money. And I take the center stage while I narrate. One moment. <laughs> I know you narrowly escaped death today, but we've got bigger things to worry about. For example, the one or two werewolves that are among you now can wake up. And if you would like to brutally murder someone in an interesting way, you must both point at the same person. Or if there's just one of you, you just have to one of you point at the same person. It's very interesting <laughs> like that. However, if there are two of you and you both don't point at the same person, that is an invalid kill attempt. All right, go back to sleep. And now, the cop! The cop still lives! <laughs> the cop should wake up now and attempt to identify a werewolf, perhaps, point at someone. If, I, uh, if you're pointing at a werewolf, I will identify them with a were W in my hand. It looks like a three, but I assure you, it's a W. It's the sign. If they're not a werewolf, I'll instead show you a V for villager. It looks like a two, but I swear it's <laughs> It's not some other sign or symbol. It means innocence of grisly murders. All right, cop, you can go back to sleep. And now the doctor can wake up and point at someone you hope to save. And then you can go back to sleep. If in fact you still live, you may be a, you may have been the hand and you may be dead. It's a very interesting turn of events. But the rest of you can wake up. The rest of you can wake up and, and enjoy this glorious day. Except you, Drew, you're yeah. dead. <laughs> you've been murdered. Most foul. <laughs> Grizzly. Blood everywhere. Yeah. Yeah. Very In nice fact, there's that. blood on all of you. I uh, can't my maid. I can't have one. <laughs> what is this on my new blue suit? <laughs> oh, thank you. Sorry. I should pay you. You want to do a job? Sure. 
One was for my hotels. <laughs> so about how chipper you were last night, you piece of garbage, princess. <laughs> oh! Always, even when people are getting hung, you sick, demented fuck. Oh! Oh! Wow. At this time, the destructive <laughs> time traveler thought, hmm, perhaps I should have been a little more harsh. Let me go back in time and revisit that. <laughs> <laughs> That. All right, you Disney slut. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Is that what you do? You get up on people dying and then you go and fucking murder them, you piece of garbage? Not at all. Oh. This is not talk talk for the House of Lord. We shut up. You're oh, gonna, oh, shut up. Like, there are certain ways to treat women, and this isn't one of them, and that's saying it a lot coming from me. Oh. Oh. Irrelevant. Did she you want to date your daughter or something like that? I, what? Have you seen her? <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> yeah. Me and this lovely person had a lovely night last night. Oh my. Um, why are you so fast to point the finger? Because she was so happy about Leanne dying. That's, 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 I'm that's weird. I'm done with this! Are you trying to do It was at this point in his life, all the violence and sex and and, and crude metaphors being uttered in front of him, that poor Tom the altar boy had his innocence finally cracked. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Where are you doing? We'll be back in like two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> two <laughs> hours <laughs> later, <laughs> he returned. <laughs> Now where were we? Oh. 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 I 
I'm sorry, Disney princess. Now, now, how? T tell us, how is it that? Uh, uh, what's the best way to kill a Disney princess? Well, there's many ways. You can just get an eraser. <laughs> What we will do? You have been erased. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you old bitches! Oh, sweetie. The rest of you may go to sleep. Now. It's a very interesting time to be a member of the town in the town of Doomsville. It's a very interesting time. For those of you who do not know how the rules in this game work, because I, as an obnoxious narrator, didn't bother to explain them all. When the werewolves equal or outnumber the town, as they now do, the werewolves <laughs> run away because they can easily overpower the few remaining town persons that are left. Yep. So werewolves, <laughs> do you want to kill your last two victims in a glorious fashion? <laughs> Hey, Phantom Musicals fans, hope you enjoyed this performance of a werewolf. Be sure to hit subscribe. We have another playthrough of this game on the way with different characters and new werewolves. You can support our Patreon to help our shows be bigger and better, and you'll get to see new shows and videos first. And if you haven't already, check out the cast of Phantom Hearts 2 that we just announced, and we'll see you guys on the next show.